Hello, my name is Lauren Vincent, Quality Consultant for Registry Partners. Welcome to the June 2023 CTR Coding Break. Today's topic is lymphovascular invasion. What is lymphovascular invasion? Lymphovascular invasion is the presence of tumor cells in lymphatic channels and or blood vessels within the primary tumor, noted microscopically by the pathologist. In some cases, the presence or absence of lymphovascular invasion is used as an indicator of prognosis. Today's objectives include identifying synonyms for lymphovascular invasion, rules for applying codes 0, 8, and 9, and understanding coding lymphovascular invasion with, in cases with neoadjuvant therapy. Coding instructions state the primary source of information regarding lymphovascular invasion is the pathology checklist or synoptic report. If the case does not have a checklist or synoptic report, code from the pathology report of the primary tumor, biopsy or resection, or a physician statement in that order. If lymphovascular invasion is identified in any specimen from the primary tumor, it should be coded as present. Synonyms for lymphovascular invasion include, but are not limited to, angiolymphatic invasion, blood vessel invasion, lymph vascular emboli, lymphatic invasion, vascular invasion, and lymphovascular space invasion. This list is located on page 137 of the SEER Program Coding and Staging Manual. Apply code 1 if the pathology report or physician statement indicates that lymphovascular invasion or one of its synonyms is present in the specimen. Applying code zero, eight, and nine. Code zero indicates LVI is not present and not identified. Store instructs to use code zero when the pathology report indicates there is no lymphovascular invasion. This includes in situ cancers, which biologically have no access to lymphatic or vascular channels below the basement membrane. We can apply code zero for an in situ case, even if LVI is not mentioned on the pathology report. Code eight or not applicable. Coding instructions indicate to apply code eight for benign brain and CNS tumors gastrointestinal stromal tumors, or GIST, and for heme and lymphoma histologies. Store page 148 contains a list of schema IDs that must be coded to 8, not applicable. Code 8 should also be used when your standard setter does not require this item and the state and central registry are not collecting it. Code 9, unknown or indeterminate, is used when LVI is not documented on the pathology report. There is no microscopic tissue examination from the primary site. The primary site specimen is cytology only and in cases where the primary site is unknown. For cases treated with neoadjuvant therapy, STORE instructs us to refer to the table on page 146 to code the data field. The table should be used to code the data field based on the results of LVI on the pathology report prior to neoadjuvant therapy in column one, and the results of LVI on the pathology report after neoadjuvant therapy, column two, and column three indicates the code entered into the data field in your registry software. For example, if lymphovascular invasion was present prior to neoadjuvant therapy, but not present after new adjuvant therapy, the table instructs us to code the lymphovascular invasion data field to one present. If lymphovascular invasion is identified in any specimen before or after neoadjuvant therapy, the data field will be coded to one present. Case example number one. LVI was documented on a biopsy pathology report prior to neoadjuvant therapy as not present, not identified. The results of LVI were not documented on the surgical pathology report after neoadjuvant therapy. Using the table, LVI would be coded to nine or unknown. Case 
Case example number two. A core needle biopsy of the left breast was positive for nuclear grade 2 DCIS. A left breast lumpectomy was performed and positive for nuclear grade 2 DCIS measuring 0.5 centimeters surgical margins negative. LVI will be coded to zero, not present, or not identified. The pathology report made no mention of lymphovascular invasion, but store coding instruction indicates all inside two cases are coded to zero. I hope you found this information helpful. Thank you for watching.